Welcome to episode 2 of our Big Bucky Showdown. If you missed episode 1, we'll put a link in the description below. We gathered some of the most incredible Buckies in South Africa for an epic drag race shootout. All of these Buckies are not as they seem. The Hilux has a V8 C63 AMG engine. The Ram has a Jeep Trackhawk engine. The Raptor has a few upgrades. The Amarok has a BMW 330D engine. And this Savage Ranger has a V8 Mustang engine. In the first episode, we drew names out of a hat. But in this episode, we're going to line them up, like for like. Let's see what happens. It's race time. Think of a car, any car. Yes, cars.coza. Let's find what moves you. Okay, so obviously this, I would say, is the underdog. And I just thought I should ask Beat, like, do you drive this every day, dude? Yeah, it's my daily driver. Like what I'm talking to the other guys, it's the buggy is costing me around 200k. So yeah, it's underdog and it's a cheap daily driver and we enjoy it very much. So now we're spicing things up a little. We're trying to like for like the buckies right now. These are two rear wheel drives, very powerful buckies. Obviously that's got a BMW engine in it. This one's got a Mustang engine in it. It's still bucky wars, right? Let's get them lined up. Come, 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 come. Whoa! Three, two, one, go! It looks very tight. I don't know, it looks like the Mustang took it, but that 330 BMW slash VW Amarok looks like it got very close. So I think it's also important to find out from this man, Uncle Kev. Yes. <laughs> uh, what are you packing in your bucky? Okay, on the, on the interview last time, I didn't exactly say, I, I, I kept a bit back, but okay, this comes in as a Coyote motor. Okay. So Ford racing team is the, uh, the, the Coyotes. That is the same motor that's in the new Mustang, yes. I see. But it's got a supercharger bolted on top of it. That supercharger gives you another 250, 300 horses. So it's rated with a placard from America is uh, 660 horsepower. Remember guys, that's crank power, eh? So that doesn't tell you too much. From there, you've got to get it through onto the tar. Okay. So the way we're doing it here is the most sophisticated way, which is a prop shaft and two wheels. Yeah, this thing um, has packs a lot of power, but two wheel drive, yeah, um, that makes it a bit difficult and I've got a six-speed manual. Oh. I think I'm the only manual car here today. The Ranger Raptor is now up against uh, the Ram. Now that Ram is of course the Trackhawk Ram. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to line them up and let's see how they do on the race. Come on, Ranger Raptor, let's line it up. Come, 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 come. Okay, driver ready. Driver ready. There we go, on go. Three, two, one. No! is the king that was close that was a good race damn good race obviously there's people who've seen the video of your car but oh, yeah. the nice thing about why we're doing this is that 
there's new subscribers, new viewers. It's going to come up on someone's timeline. And then they're going to be like, what does that Ford Ranger actually have? What, what, what do you have in the car? Uh, well, uh, as far as motor and turbo is concerned, stock. Okay. It's still stock issue and untuned issue. Uh, we can't tune it yet. So the turbos are still factory turbos, engine still completely factory. Uh, we've got exhaust system on it, uh, a DT system, which is like a piggyback okay. to alter the boost a little bit. Uh, intercooler and then water meth kit. Ah, and okay. a BMC filter, that's it. So he's no stranger on the channel. His name is Quinton, Uncle Quinton. It's okay. always a pleasure, always a pleasure. Always fun playing with you. <laughs> now tell us, what made you decide that you want to take out the engine and put a totally different engine, that being a Trackhawk engine? Because I can't leave anything standard. That's why we like you on the channel. <laughs> yeah, so basically I use this to tow one of my race car trailers and stuff like that. Okay. Then I bought a Trackhawk that was an accident and me and Tina's from US Trucks, we decided and we put it in. <laughs> and I had a lot of help from them and it's done now, it's sorted. I'm very happy with it. I'm actually quite very impressed with it as well. Even it's when you're towing? Time. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time we actually tested it now and I'm very happy with it. It's, oh it's a daily. I drive over the assemblers. I go down to the coast with the whole family and the dogs. and the Comfortable, trailer. yeah. 100%, 100%. I just love it. So obviously because there's a Ford and another Ford, we had to put the Fords together, right? But I'm going to ask, because one of the Fords are actually, the Mustang Fords actually uh, rear wheel drive. So I'm going to ask Uncle Mike here. What's up? Hello Uncle Mike. <laughs> What's up? So tell me, can we now make this one rear wheel drive since seeing the other one is rear wheel drive? Yeah, you can do it. I'll just change the settings a bit. Okay, there we go. Simple as that. Okay, sounds like a plan. I'm just trying to level you guys up. Don't worry, I'm on your team. <laughs> Mustang, Ford, rock and roll. Come this way, come this way, come this way, come this way. Are you guys ready? You ready? You ready? Okay, cool. Here we go. One, two, three, go! Another firm build, another firm favorite. I just want to start. What made you think I'm going to take a C63 engine and put it in a Hilux Bucky? Because I think that's two very popular cars in South Africa. No, 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 uh, no, no, a 63 AMG no. is a special, very special engine. And then a Hilux, it's like halo Bucky for a lot of other Bucky people. Uh, what, what made you join the two? It's, it's never been done. You know, everybody's asking, why didn't you put a Lexus? Why has everyone else got a Lexus in their cars? I mean, that's, that's their choice. That's their line. I love to be different, like I saw you with the Dodge as well, be different, I love to be different. Now, ever since this car was uh, featured on the channel, uh, were there any other changes that you've done? We've actually changed the gearbox, it's now it's got a DCT, okay. WM3 DCT box in here, and it's working quite well. Okay. And we did the first video where it had a normal D4D. Oh, I see. In it. Okay. So we made some improvements, it's a definitely an improvement. And now, time for the grand finale! <laughs> That's an evil laugh because, I mean, look what's happening here. There's some grand cars lining up. So it's Quinton versus Quinton. Uh, as you know, he's driving the Ram, which has got a Trackhawk engine. And then, of course, there's the C63 AMG Toyota Hilux. This is definitely the mother of all drag races. These two cars were basically the firm favorites today. They were the best of the best of the Bucky, so we decided let's put the best against the best. So I'm gonna line them up. I'll start with the AMG Hilux on this side. AMG, Swagala AMG, AMG. Driver one, you ready? Driver two, you ready? On go, here we go. One, two, three, go! Go! I 
was fun. That was fun. And plus the AMG was just burning. Did you see that? Just burning rubber. That was really cool. Wow, wow. Whew. Hi, 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 hi. Today was a day, guys. Today was a day. Yo, 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 yo. The launch control series has been amazing. A Bucky shootout like no other. And we got to give it to the Hilux AMG. It definitely was the shining star today. And of course, it's sibling, the Ram Trackhawk. Amazing, amazing car. And you know what this all tells you? It tells you that you can build a really cool Bucky at a budget and still have fun. You can also build an amazing Bucky with a bigger budget and you'll still have just as much fun. So if you have a favorite Bucky, don't forget to let us know which one it is. Leave a comment there at the bottom. And then also, if you're looking for a Bucky and you're getting inspired to build your dream Bucky, make sure you go to cars.coza. There are thousands of Buckys for you to choose from. Don't forget to like and subscribe as well. And I'll see you in the next video. If you have any other suggestions on what we should race, what we should do in our next launch control video, let us know in the comments below. It's been an epic day. Shout out to everybody. Yeah, from me, Jacob Mushukwa. I love you. Bye-bye. What's the car with cars.coza? Say Avzat to Andre Durki Oosthuizen. You'll find him in his Bakuzi, the hot spot of the Freistaat summer. Lekker. Now think of a car, any car. Yes, we have it. Cars.coza. Let's find what moves you.